Trump seems to be gaining popularity. I'm not very happy about that, but his approval rating is now at 53%. Obama's approval rating at this point in his presidency was 47%. So he's doing better than Obama was at this point in his presidency. Trump's approval rating for how he's handling the economy is at 58%. Now, many of my fellow lefties have been trying to tell me, oh, well, no, that's just a temporary. The, the economy thing is just a temporary. It's going to tank because it, it, Trump doesn't really have anything to do with how well the economy is going. And the things that he's doing are actually going to make it worse. And when it tanks, it's going to tank worse than ever. Oh, yeah, you, I guess you have a lot of faith in our country. It just seems some of you want the economy to tank just so you can point and say, see, see, Trump is crap. Now, I, again, I, I don't like Trump, but I, I wouldn't wish bad on the country just because I don't like Trump. Oh, well, we're not wishing it will go bad. We just think it's inevitable. You think it's inevitable. Why? Well, the ebb and flow of the economy. Yes, that, that does happen, but when things go good, you'll blame a democratic president. You'll, you'll put the, you'll say that it's a democratic president that is why it's going good. And anytime something bad happens to the economy, you blame it on the Republican president. That seems pretty partisan to me. And now, mainstream media, except for Fox News and other right-wing media, are outraged that Bill Barr is saying that he thinks that there was spying on the Trump campaign in 2016. Outraged, I tell you, outraged. Outraged, really? After two years of media saying, uh, Trump, collusion, Russia, Russia, Russia. And Rachel Maddow. And it is like negative 50 degrees in the Dakotas right now. What would happen if Russia killed the power in Fargo today? Right? What would happen if all the natural gas lines that, that service Sioux Falls just poofed on the coldest day in recent memory and it wasn't in our power whether or not to turn them back on? I mean, what would you do if you lost heat indefinitely as the act of a foreign power on the same day the temperature in your front yard matched the temperature in, our, in, in Antarctica? I mean, what would you and your family do? And yet you're outraged because Bill Barr said that there, there, there was probably... Well, he says that he thinks that there was spying on the, the Trump campaign in 2016. That's interesting. That's interesting. Yeah, at this rate, I don't know how Trump could lose in 2020. I'm not saying I want him to win, but uh, at the rate things are going... And at the rate that people are starting to not give a shit about what media says, mainstream media, people are losing faith in the media. Yeah, it just seems like Trump can't lose in 2020. I'm not seeing the Democrats get their shit together like they should, but maybe they will. Let's hope they do. But go ahead and, and cross your fingers that everything will turn to shit in this country just so just so you can blame it on Trump. Yeah, that's that's great. I just think that that kind of mindset's kind of disgusting. Sorry.